Here's me attempting to make a cake in a bread maker. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Also, if this video can reach 5 likes, then I will do more cake vlogs. And also, I upload the Canada video a week early. So, I'll upload it next week at some point. So, come on guys, 5 likes. Let's go. Coming up in today's video. I got the measurements a bit wrong. That's that's about right. Some silly jokes. Apparently, you got to beat him up. Come on, Legs, fight me. Plus, lots more things that go wrong. What for the ah! Guys, welcome back to another video. Today, I'm gonna be making a cake inside a bread maker. Let's go. First of all, we need to uh, tidy up all the mess. <laughs> That's done, we can now uh, make the cake. Let's go. It's gonna get far, be right back. Come on. So this thing I'm gonna use is called a bread maker. Um I've no clue how you use it, but I've only done it like once. So this is like four years ago. Okay, so before we begin, here's what the bread maker looks like. It's this massive thing. Okay, so I've got the uh, the recipe because it's a separate recipe instead of making normal cakes. Um, but yeah, butter melted. Got to melt the butter. Three quarters of a cup. Okay. Okay. What is three quarters? Mm, I know. The measuring jug. The butter. Okay. Well, folks, okay. Should be up to here, I'm guessing. Oh, that's, that's about right. Okay, now you just got to melt it and put it in the microwave. So that's now melting away in the microwave. Um, while that's cooking, will be the next step. So the next step is uh, I've lost it. Look how much things are on it. Look at that. Um, up next is eggs, beaten eggs, apparently got beat them up, here are three medium eggs, apparently you got to beat them up, come on eggs, fight me, well at least the butter's done, look at that, looks like orange juice, Then you gotta beat him up. I get a fork. This is like custard. Okay, should be about done. Plain flour. One five out of eight cups. Um, what does that mean? One five over eight cup. I don't know. <laughs> Alright, so I've just done really, really daft here. 
I looked inside the bread maker and I found these. Now, this looks like cups, right? But this is an actual measuring uh, cups, which actually tells you what the cups are. So basically, I might have got I might have done the butter a bit wrong. <laughs> oh. Well, um, I just don't know what to do. Okay, so I'm going to decide to do the flour first, as I'm as good at the plan to. So, yeah, just ignore the butter for now, so I'll do the butter last. Alright. Now you can see what I'm actually doing. Right, so that's a cup. Look at them selling up ice cream. Everybody extended bit in should be all right. Where's the jug gone? Where's the cup gone? Where is the cup gone? I've lost it. All right, I figured it out. I've just realised. Yeah, I used it for the butter. One cup, which is this. Oh, this sugar is all hard. Oh, hard sugar. Got everything apart from that's the fridge. So got everything apart from baking powder. Um, I'll skip it. It should be fine. It's the mixture. Yeah. Okay. Now what? The mixing. Yeah. No idea why I just did that, but oh well. Let's go! What? What is it? Oh, because it needs switching on. One rule is you must always switch on a mixture first. you need baking powder to rise if not the cake will just be very very flat and plus i didn't put any self rosin flour in it's just plain so that means it would have like it would have just gone very very flat and all wrong so i decided to run to the shop to get some baking powder okay so a bit of emergency use i had to quickly run to the shop and to get some baking powder and yes we have got my brother as well he's returned um but yes, so we've got to start again and quickly open this. Yeah. Is it in? Yes, you have this now. Oh, cookie's stuck. Hang on, the guinea pig's cookie. stuck. I'll be right back. Cookie, Ooh. cookie, cookie stuck, quick. Basically, one of our guinea pig is uh, stuck downstairs. Stuck downstairs and trying to get up. Don't climb up, Cookie. All right, Cookie's been saved. 
Sophie's one of our guinea pigs. She's got loads of She's them. a very funny guinea pig. Anyway, back to the We've got six word. guinea pigs. All right, all right, I don't want that. Um, Look at plain flower, not, not self-raising. I don't know what I've done, I can't even remember. Uh, oh, whatever. Whatever I did, it's going to be good. All right, now we've got to mix this up again. Have we done everything? Did you put caster sugar? Yes, I did. Oi, what have we done? Don't drop that. Right, so we're basically done. Mix it away, just need to get... Oh, sugar. Uh, they're all in the sink now. Oh, the, sink, the sinks are bleaching. What? The sinks are, ble the sinks are bleaching. We'll have to wash them. Or, quickly just mix it up by hand. Or, we can do it by spoon or fork. I won't do it by Agreed. fork. Agreed. Just do it by fork. I won't the spoon. No, get a fork, get a fork. Spoon. Get a fork, because then it can go in between the things like it does in the whisk. Fair enough. <laughs> Be mixing up, or I'll be tidying up the mess. Mm. Right. Okay, guys, so here's the bread maker. Of course, you can cook. Basic white bread, French bread, whole wheat, quick, sweet, dough, fast, bake, jam, you can cook cakes, you can cook sandwich eggs to bake. Oh, well, that failed. Cakes. That was so blurry. Look at that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Spatula or... <laughs> Okay, right, next we shut the lid. Can I just switch it on? Alright, time to test the cake. Look at that. Now, the last time I baked the cake, it tastes like popcorn, so you never know. Oh, that is perfect. I finally made a perfect cake. With no mistakes. Well, there was a bit of mistakes. And that was how to make a cake in a bread maker. Be sure to like and subscribe. And remember, if this video can get five likes, I will upload Canada super early. And uh, yeah, go to next week. So five likes. And um, yeah, I actually made a cake. That was good. Bye-bye. <laughs>